Good morning, everyone. All right, so we are headed out. We are in Cadiz in Spain. Um, and we have no tour today. We're just gonna walk around and see what we see. Good morning, Cadiz. How wild is this fog? You can see the water a little bit. And then nothing. So this is great. We got a whole map and she outlined all the places that we can go. And we're just gonna follow the map. Oh, 20th century. The Plaza de España y Monumento a las Cortes was built in 1925 making use of the large space resulted from the demolition of part of the walled precinct. So it's raining a lot. It said there was going to be a 20% chance of rain to Victoria all right so I finally found an ATM and I got some money out I only got out 20 bucks because I don't think the next place we need euros I'm not quite sure so we're just gonna get like a snack or something and uh, I used Google Translate to use the ATM and it worked out perfectly. into the big cathedral um, it is six euros to get into the cathedral and so we decided to pass on it the outside is beautiful though so they gave us to try sunflower seeds with caramel it's really good We found a little cafe and we got pizza to go. All right, so we're walking along the streets. They're beautiful cobblestone trees and we're looking for a castle or a light tower. We're not quite sure. Um, there's also supposed to be a beach. Um, if you can see, there's not like a clear area from like the sidewalk and the street. So I'm kind of like in the street. Ariel's kind of like on the sidewalk a little bit but they're so small. Uh, we also found the school, which is the University of Cadiz. Hey, right, we found the beach. And it's really cold today, as you've seen from the video, so we are not going out there, but look at all the little boats out there. Up here must be the um, the castle. So we have found the castle, the beach, and the watchtower on the other side of basically the world. We're gonna try and go in. I'm not sure if you have to pay to go in or not, but we're gonna try. This castle was built on the orders of Felipe II.
beautiful up here and I think all the tourists have basically abandoned and gone back onto the ship because it was raining so much this morning but it is gorgeous the sun has come out and we're on this beautiful castle and we're living looking at the water Over there is where there's a light tower and so we are gonna walk over that way it looks like it's walkable so we're gonna head over that way so we can see maybe you can climb to the top we'll see walk on the bridge we have to get to the bridge on a very pretty pathway there's buildings over there I don't know if you can see them they're bigger in real life but it's really pretty here all right I believe this bridge goes to the watchtower and that is where we are going okay. Closed, so we couldn't go in. Sorry. All right, we are headed back. I will see if we can find Ariel some shoes because her shoes are still a little bit wet.
Zara shopping because Ariel's shoes, I don't know if you can tell, but they are soaking wet. Mine are fine, we have matching shoes. Mine are okay, but Ariel's shoes are soaking wet. So we're gonna get her these boots over here from Zara. Um, if they can find our size. So we're waiting to see if they have it. We found Ariel some shoes. <laughs> All right, we are headed back to the ship. We had a lot of fun in Cadiz, but now our feet hurt and we have to get back on the ship. Plus, we're hungry. Looks like what without the crazy shock, it kind of looks like Diagon Alley. Diagon Alley, she's filming me film, but I edit the videos so I can just edit all of this out. Pass me. Oh, careful. If you see this thing hanging out with my backpack over here, that's just the oh. um, that's the umbrella. God is so thick. Does anyone see the boat right there? I think that's a boat. As usual, we got ourselves a little lost. Uh, we started walking back towards the city center or back towards the ship, and the roads are not um, perfect squares. They curve, and so we ended up right back to the beach after about 20 minutes of walking. So now I have the map out and we are just looking at the map as we walk. And hopefully we get back to the ship. It's easy to navigate. We didn't even get lost a lot, a little bit. We went in a little bit of a circle. We got lost. I, my hair was in a beautiful messy bun and it was brushed back right here. Do you want instructions on how to do that? Cause here they are. It's just three simple steps. Number one, put your hair in a perfect, beautiful bun. Step two, be bored for an hour and roll around your stateroom, living room, or bedroom. Step three, realize that you have to go to dinner in five minutes and you don't have time to actually comb out your hair, so just brush up this part. And that's all you need to know. Step four, enjoy it but make sure do not wear it for more than 24 hours. It's painful. 